Hey guys, it's Jacob from Living Healthy Every Day. I was such in a state when I was younger, I was in this unconscious state of just doing things, just doing things and not even thinking about how it impacted my body, how my body felt. I would drink milkshakes and, and stay up all night and drink Mountain Dew and do all these horrible things to my body and spike my blood sugar and mess up my glucose and do all these different things that were detrimental to my health and I would never listen to my brain until it was too late. And I've got these patients that I've been working with that aren't listening to their self, listen to their bodies. And I've become so accustomed now to listen to myself that I've been able to diagnose things before doctors have been able to diagnose it such as having biliary dyskinesia with my gallbladder. I was able to figure out through my body and reading labs I've had that I had a problem with my gallbladder and it took months to convince doctors that there was something wrong with my gallbladder. Months to convince them when I knew what was going on with my body. And doctors get all these patients that read things online and are, are, are internet ology uh, degrees um, and I, I understand doctors get enough of that and they're lazy and they don't want to have to deal with insurance and things like that. But when you really listen to your body and know what's up, like me, you can diagnose yourself. You just have to listen to your body. So I'm going to show you, share with you a way that I use to listen to my body. So what I like to do is I like to meditate and clear out all the thoughts that are coming in my head. So when I meditate, I let a thought come in, I let it pass by. I let a thought come in and then pass by until all these thoughts are gone. Once all the thoughts are gone, then I can focus on my breathing and focus on what in my body is aching, where I'm feeling it, and then I can draw the connection. So if I feel pain in my lower right quadrant or lower right um, rib area here, then I know it could be my gallbladder or my liver. And if I feel pain in my stomach, I can really pinpoint, oh, is that my stomach or is that my spleen? What is going on? It does help knowing the anatomy of the body too, but really knowing like, is my heart broken or is this an emotional state just getting past a relationship? Or do I really have brain fog or is there inflammation in my brain? So this is something to take in consideration, really getting in tune with your body because once you know what's going on with your body, you can fix it. And I'm here to help you to fix it. You can always schedule a consult with me. I'd be happy to teach you and co coaching with your mindset. So I hope this was some value to you guys, this video. So thanks guys for watching. Comment in the section below if you listen to yourself, if you listen to your body. So thanks guys and stay beautiful.